Carly wants to start her own business, but to do this, she's going to need money, and a lot of it. She determines that she will need $500,000 to start, so she goes to the bank to take out a business loan, but the bank will only give her $200,000, so Carly decides to issue stock to investors for the remaining money needed. Stocks are shares of ownership in a company. Each share is valued at a certain amount based on the worth of the company at any given time. Because Carly still needs $300,000 after the bank loan, Carly issues stocks to three separate outside investors. When she does this, she has to give up 60% of her company in shares as $300,000 would make up 60% of the company's value if it's worth $500,000. In exchange for the money, Carly now owns 40% of her company while the investors each own 20%. Carly's business is a massive success. The company once worth $500,000 is now worth $5 million. Carly's initial investment of $200,000 is now worth $2 million, while each investor also has made money. In the same way that the investors purchase Carly's stock, you can purchase stock in publicly traded companies.